I welcome you to today's spiritual breakfast. I bring greetings to you. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Very good morning and I'm happy that God has brought us together to meditate this for today. Hello everyone, praise the Lord. Very good morning. I'm happy that God has given us a new day and also we are in the last day of this week. So take this day to give thanks to him for his faithfulness throughout this week. And he has been, uh, he has led us, he has been with us, he has blessed all our labors. So give thanks unto him, his presence was with us. And even today as we meditate his word through the spiritual breakfast session, surely God will speak to us. Today's meditation is from the book of Acts chapter 21 verse 30. The whole city was aroused and the people came running from all directions. Seizing Paul, they dragged him from the temple and immediately the gates were shut. So when Apostle Paul tried to please men, this is the second tragedy that is happening in the life of Apostle Paul. The very first thing was when he tried to please men, the same men he tried to please turned against him. But now when he tried to please men, the secondly, he has been dragged out of the temple. Imagine he has the right to go into the temple. He was a, he was a Jew and he was also considered as a, a Roman. We can... Uh, I don't want to explain it since, since uh, because of the uh, limited time we have. But he was a Jew and also a Roman. He was a Jew. He can, he can go inside the temple and worship God. He had the right to go inside. But when he pleased men, when he tried to please the people, imagine what happens. He lost the precious right he had. He was dragged out of the temple and the temple gates were shut. I want to tell you, when you try to please men around you, when you try to please people around you, you will lose the benefit you are experiencing. You will lose the right you have. You may have it than the other people. People around you may not have it, but you may have it. But when you try to please men, you will lose it. It is, it, is a, it is a precious thing. It is a privilege. I will tell you. You will lose the privilege you are, you are enjoying when you please men. So never please men. But try to please always God alone. And you will, you will safeguard all these things. Amen.